I'm going to show you a secret function of the VIP to put two floors on Brookhaven's houses. Everyone knows that the VIP Game Pass has many benefits. It's also Brookhaven's most expensive Game Pass. Everyone imagined that this Game Pass would give access to some exclusive house, but that hasn't happened yet. That's why I'm going to add a house. Perfect. I'm going to put this house because this is a premium house and it's very big. In my opinion, this is one of the most beautiful houses in Brookhaven. However, this Game Pass VIP has some secret functions. For example, if I click on my avatar here, I can enter my RP name and look at that I can just put my name in color that was a function that not many people realized so this Game Pass VIP has a lot of secrets for example here in Game Pass VIP I can put two cars in at the same time then I also want to know if I can put two floors on my house in Brookhaven these are all the Game Passes I have in Brookhaven look I only bought a few I didn't buy them all for example this Game Pass for unlocking songs I didn't buy it I didn't buy the vehicle upgrade either but I'll click here on Game Pass VIP and here I can find out all the benefits that this Game Pass gives you access to. However, I can also find out about this inside Brookhaven, but that's not what I want to know. I want to find out how many likes this Game Pass has. Lo and behold, it has 1310 likes. That means that more than 1300 people have bought this Game Pass. And as a comparison, I'm going to look at Game Pass Premium, which has 233,000 likes. So it's a very big difference. Of course, Game Pass Premium is much cheaper than Game Pass VIP. But what I realized is that the Game Pass VIP was a failure at Brookhaven because very few people compared it. You can't even compare 1,300 likes to 233,000 likes. The difference is too great. And because of this, Brookhaven's owner put some secret functions in the Game Pass VIP to try to increase the number of sales. But the first thing I want to find out, I want to try to do some trick to get another floor in my house. Here are all the settings for my house. Look, there's a way I can put a sign in front of my house. A colored sign. I want to put this blue sign. There's also a way to change the color of my house. I want to make it orange. Perfect. And here I also have access to the security cameras. But everyone already knows knows that exists here in Brookhaven. I want to try to find some function so that I can have another floor here in my Brookhaven house. Look, there are several features of the house here. There are even features that are only for premium people, which in this case would be this swimming pool. How cool is that? Only premium people can have a pool at Brookhaven? I didn't know that. There are also some disaster functions, which are also from another game pass. I activated this disaster called lights. I don't know what's going to happen. Apparently nothing is happening. So I don't know what this disaster does. I'm going to remove it and put in alien because this disaster is really cool. Look, there's an alien literally on top of my Brookhaven house. I'll leave that alien there. And down here, there's also a way for me to set my house on fire. Look at that. My house is just going to start on fire out of nowhere here in Brookhaven. But I want access to the top floor of my house. There, that's this floor. Now I'm going to open my backpack and get a ladder. But I need to find a way to get to the top of my house. It's proving to be quite a difficult task. Wow, I did it. I've made it to the top of my house. Look at that. I'm literally at the top. And the alien is very close to me. And I'm going to show you a way to get another floor. I need to open my backpack and get the props. Perfect. Here in the props, I need to find walls. Perfect. I found these walls. And I'm going to put these walls here in my house. Wow. Look at that. A gear has appeared. No way. I can change the color. I'll put white so that it's similar to the wall in my house. Okay, now I need to put this wall around my house so it looks perfect. Perfect. I finished putting up all the walls. I wanted to change the color of all the walls at the same time, but that's impossible. So I'm going to leave it at that. Now, I need to find some way of decorating my house. In fact, I need to create a room. I'm going to create a room here. A really big one. Perfect. I'm creating a room for myself. There, I've created my room. Now, I need a door. I need to find where the door is on the Brookhaven props so I can put it in. Perfect. I've already created my room. It already has a door, but something very important is missing. A bed? No, a gaming computer. Because I need a gaming computer in order to live. Okay, I'll put that gaming computer in now. Okay, now I need a bed. Once I've got my gaming computer, I can put up a bed. I'm even gonna put in a big bed, a bunk bed. Wow, look at that. This bed is very, very big. It's amazing. Now I need to secure the door to my house, and I'm gonna put in some VIP items. Look at that. No one will break into my house for sure. That's it. My house is totally protected with this VIP item. But everyone knows that these are just props and don't look that great, right? Because these walls aren't realistic. Because you can see through this wall, right? Because this wall has a lot of holes in it. And apparently here at Brookhaven, there are no items that are similar to a wall. There's this railing, but even then, it's not perfect. Look at that. You can see through the grid. There's also this item that you can also see through the grills. Look at that. So no item is perfect. 
And that's why I'm going to show you a really cool way to add another floor to your house in Brookhaven. That's why I opened Roblox Studio. Lo and behold, I've already managed to add many floors to this house. However, I'm going to remove these floors a little because this house has too many floors. Okay, I only want to add two floors. Actually, it would be three floors, right? And there's also this giant staircase that I'm also going to remove. I'm going to leave it at this height, which I think is perfect. I've also added this unique building because this building doesn't exist in the real Brookhaven. And I'm going to test my Brookhaven right now. I hope it's working because now I'll finally have a two-story house here in Brookhaven. Perfect. I've already entered my Brookhaven and I think I have a big problem because the staircase has literally been destroyed. Look at that. The staircase is here on the ground. So I want to know how I'm going to get up to the second floor of my house. And it worked. My house actually has two floors. I've managed to add another floor to my house. And I'm going to try to get inside my house. I don't know if it will work because the staircase was destroyed, but I hope it does. Perfect. At least the door is open and my name isn't that. My name is Capolar. I think this is wrong. That's certainly not my name. Perfect. I've already entered the house and I'm going to access the second floor. Okay, now I need to access the third floor, but I don't know how I'm going to do that because look, the third floor is very high. I think I've come up with a very good idea. I'm going to access this house next door and I need to try to climb to the top of this house. Wow, it almost worked. I needed to jump a little higher for me to get to the top of this house. Luckily for me, I have administrator commands, so I'm going to increase my jumping power. I'm going to set my jumping power to 5,000. Woo! I think I overdid it. I don't think I should jump that high. I'll fix it because I'm jumping too high. There, I'll change it to 10. Wow, look at that. I'm jumping too low now. I need to jump a bit higher, but not that high. I'll change it to 50. Wow. 50 is too little. I couldn't get to the top of this house either. Perfect. I'll try to climb on top of this umbrella and get to the top of the house. There's really no way, but look at this. I'm already on the third floor of this house, and the only thing that's changed is that there's no staircase on the third floor. Look, and this place that was supposed to be empty has actually become a room. Down here, it's completely free. Look at that. There's no floor, and here's the staircase. And on the third floor, there's no staircase, and here it's become a room. That's all that's changed. But now, I want to access the upper part. That's why I'm going to change my jumping power. I'm going to increase it to 100. That way, I can jump much higher and access the roof of my house. And it really worked. I managed to have two floors here in Brookhaven. But unfortunately, in the real Brookhaven, I couldn't add another floor to the house. I hope that in the future, the owner of Brookhaven will put this feature in. It would be amazing. If you like this video, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Bye.